one this is the best fit for my catfish i said use high quality ingredient for your feed uh, formulation how do you know you are using an, an high quality ingredient you can know this by one the standard of the ingredient by the time you put it in your hand and you see number one physical smell with this you can know number three go take it to the test to confirm if it's right or not consider feed conversion ratio these are where a lot of farmers are getting it wrong feed conversion ratio what are your feed conversion ratio many people do not know what to call feed conversion ratio many people do not know how to calculate your conversion ratio many people do not know that it is important for you to have a good conversion ratio for your fishes note your feed your fish to me your feed are being fed to your fishes based on the conversion ratio if i'm having a lower conversion ratio and you're having a higher conversion ratio the feed that you are giving to your fishes must be you know, may not be the same because you don't just feed on assumption you don't just feed because i normally see some people that how do you feed they say i feed to saturation you don't feed to saturation sometimes depending on the quality of feed you are using it doesn't work and if you want to feed to saturation that means you are aging for a particular range you are aging for a particular lifespan to sell your fishes if you are fishing to saturation you must note that in four months i must achieve one kilo and if you are feeding to saturation you exceeded the four months i bet you you totally run at a loss so these are what you need to check so i think i would have to take my time to explain this to make it a topic maybe after this consider your feed uh, your feed conversion ratio aims for feed formulations that promote efficient feed conversion a well-balanced diet can contribute to optimal growth rate and minimize your waste so those are just the summary of what I just talked about for those of you who can get it.